now salesforce or which is an organization in short we call org now in salesforce org or organization org is nothing but a the memory space allocated for the client now what are the client has purchased the salesforce client is purchasing the salesforce is nothing but they are allocating the space for their customer information within the instance and the region as soon as the salesforce access we have received is nothing but in the region right in the region and there are different instances are available within the instance there is a some spaces allocated for our org there is a some spaces allocated for org so each client will have a unique organization id each client will have a unique organization id that means as soon as the org is created now in salesforce in salesforce salesforce is going to create a a table will be there in the salesforce side this table is a organization let's assume that this is a organization information in this organization information as soon as the org id is created within this org it will be a row side columns the data will be here there is a org id will be there and what is the organization name here swapna id is the org name swapna id is the org name so this is how the data will be stored within the organization so each client will have a unique organization if you create another or again you will receive the another organization id now where can we see the organization information within the salesforce now if you go to the setup the organization profile contains all the details and where can we see setup or administrator company profiles or else you can directly search the company profiles or company information company information when you search the company information you will see this screen this is the organization profile information this is the organization profile information that means all the information is available within this organization profile now let's go ahead and show you that you know, setup we are already in a setup i'm going to search company information company information click on this company information now once you click on this company information you will be able to see the or company information about this swapna id because when you are creating the or or that time you have specified what is the company now in this company now we are going to see the details about the organization profile now here it's going to say that what is your organization edition right so it's a developer edition it's a developer edition and what is the instance which instance the org is created ap27 the instance is the org is created within the instance is called ap27 now here organization id is this is the unique id every org will have a different id so that means whenever you create a salesforce org there is a some unique id that gets generated you can see that id information in the company information instead of search for a company information you will see the company information here and current month what is the restricted login now how many times it is logged in now it is going to show now this is what is the space that is allocated what is the space that is allocated for the data storage as well as for the file so the storage which is available is pi mb pi mb data is available and 20 mb file storage is available out of this salesforce is already used the 322 kb that means whenever the org is created the salesforce is going to provide you certain information like in the account object there are few records will be there so salesforce by default give you certain data certain data they will give you so that means salesforce is going to use the 322 kb is already used by the salesforce and 13 kb file storage is already used by the salesforce now percentage used see six percent it suggests a zero percent file storage right this is the data storage and file storage similarly we have a big object storage 
So this is big object storage is something like a, we will talk about the big object storage that is a, re, re, similar to the object, but it has a huge space where you can store the entire information or entire object details inside the big object. So which is a 10 lakhs is available in it. So this is how the storage, you can see the information. Instance is AB27. Now AB27 is a, or if it is a NEA150, that means it's a US client. AB27 is nothing but India, India client. Now, for example, here I have a, now I have choose the India. Now, if you look at the default time zone is, standard time zone is India. And currency, currency is taken as a, INR currency is taken as a INR. Now, if you want to change it, we can change later. We will change it later. But right now, this is the currency. Whatever the org is created based on the org, now the currency it is going to show it in the in the INR in the rupees. Yet, default language is English India. Locality is India. Right, so address is from the in. Those are the organization edition and organization ID. It's always 15 digit. And data space is 5 MB or a 10 MB. Now, if it is a developer edition, it's a 5 MB. If it is an unlimited edition, then you will get a 10 GB. Now, file space, if it is a developer edition, you will be able to get the 20 MB. If it is a unlimited, you will get the 10 GB. So, this is how the in the real time, you will get a more space. We have a developer edition, which is a lifetime free. And Salesforce is providing the only limited space, which is a 5 MB or 20 MB. This is about the org.